and welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Fortress Craft Evolved. Alright, are we ready to kickstart this process? Oh, I think we are. Oh, it's gonna be exciting. I wanna wait till this thing's rotation is set, and then start it up. There, it's gonna flip around. There we go. And... It's burning. I'm not seeing any growth happen, though. That is strange. Time remaining is right. It's growing. It's just not growing right here. Where? Oh, it's growing way over here. That is strange. That's a first. Why would it be growing over here? Oh, well. Well, that's... That's not very big of a problem. It usually grows right around here. It's usually just this huge wave. So let's go build um, the other ones and hope they don't start growing. Because if they do, we might be in trouble. Because I don't know. So let's just run through this as quickly as we can. I want to pull in power as much as I can. Oh, leg spike. For no reason. We don't have nearly as much, you know, cryo fighting material on any of these other ones. It looks like this one's growing like crazy. Look at that. This is. This was unexpected. But. Grow it. see what happens with that. Uh, this one still shouldn't be active. So yeah, it's not, not active. Uh, are we, are we doing something worthwhile here? And why are you blasting that direction? There you go. Now I want you to turn around. Turn. Oh well. So this one should be... should be going. Oh, it's not attached? What? going on here he's attached did I does, does this mess up somewhere let's, let's fly along it and make sure intact might be bugged out I had a crash happen and so it might be bugged out because of that no guarantees no well, it's definitely connected maybe this thing can only only go do one at a time that would be unfortunate only looking for one inferno at a time well we shall see about that let's go to this one and see what happens with this one hmm please attach magma storage via fluid pipes is the timer resetting And it's definitely, uh, I don't know, that's really hard to tell. 73, 92, 71, oh, there it's, there it's getting some. I maybe just had to wait a little bit for it to actually 
actually work. It's definitely growing creep. Again, it's growing it way over here. That's very strange. Uh, so that's getting magma now. I wonder if the other one is. Uh, let's see. We're, we got all these all these safety measures in place here. So is this one over here ready to go? Try to get some power before Arthur. Oh, Arthur is out. <laughs> Good to know. Okay, how is this one doing? This one still hasn't started yet. But the timer is... It is going down. But for some reason... I'm not seeing any magma over here. And I don't know why. It's not obviously showing progress, or it's not shooting out magma, or whatever. Whatever you want to call that. Look at the power draw from my... Oh, I needed to bring boosters. Why didn't I bring boosters? Okay, so let's get the, let's get the fourth one up and running as soon as possible here. Zip back. Get back into the swing of things. And grab the power. Charge Arthur. Let Arthur charge. I will go finish off this one and hopefully be able to produce enough magma to actually power this thing. And of course, the it should be able to connect. I, I'm, I'm assuming that it's going to be able to connect. There's really no reason for it not to be able to. What is that? Oh, that's my cryobomb. Uh, well, I can fill that back up again. Just in case. Yeah, it's not seeing... Not seeing what I want it to see there. storage is just not seeing it. I mean, it does have several hundred pipe to trans uh, to uh, go through in order to see it, but let's go check our magma storage here. I think it's drawing power as well, so I need to check all the power that we're producing over here. So magma storage, it's holding. It's holding it. it, just doesn't tell me how many cryo or infernos it's connected to. Uh, and this, I should have some of these. I took all of the power, all the fuel rods from these. So it's going to be it's this will tell me if it's actually pulling power or not. These ones still have power in them. So I'm going to I'm going to grab these fuel rods. It doesn't look like it's pulling. I always thought it did pull power. It must not. Cuz I'm not seeing any change with any of these. This says it's generating power, but it's not, because it's not using fuel. Oh, this one 
Yeah, this one's definitely pulling power. Okay. So that's good to know. Uh, no, f no on that. So it was pulling power out of this, this reactor right here, and only this one. Because it doesn't look like it's going down very fast. Probably 10,000... About 10,000 power per second, give or take. And we've got lots of, many, many millions of power in there. So we're, we're doing fine. Zip up through here. Let's see how this fight is going. This one stopped. This one stopped shooting, but it, the timer is still going down. <coughs> oh, we we're having a dazzler spit out here. Really? There's really that much cryo for it to... Oh, well. Yeah, I expected a much bigger reaction of these things. Much, much bigger. As you can see by just how much power I sent down here and how many machines I have. Uh, this timer is still going down, though. And that's good. But I'm not seeing any effect of the magma. It must be getting magma because that, that little flash, need compressed magma now, that is going on and off. So it looks like it is getting magma. It's just not doing the little uh, animation on the top, probably because I've got multiple of these things going. And the game only animates one of them, possibly. But I think now the timer actually doesn't have to go all the way down to nothing. I think it will stop. Let's see, it started at about 1,800. I think it will stop at about 900. So that will, that is the ultimate test here. Got lots of cryo bombs. Not a whole lot of cryo in the middle here. We, we have another spawner. If we take that coordinate and we go on either side, this way and that way, we'll find another spawner, another 320 meters out. And you gotta take out all eight spawners if you wanna get to the magical next level, which is uh, the orbital railgun, which is kind of a final end game test of how efficient your factory is. That's the intent anyway. And I was hoping to have that ready to show in this playthrough, in this series. Um, but the developer recently did a huge change and added uh, translation support into the game and that has completely hosed the whole process so the the code it, the game is very very broken in the last two months and there's been just a ton of work trying to get it to work but overall unfortunately uh, not doing so hot so there's been no new patches for a couple months now and it might not be ready to show on on the series by the time we get to that point. Looks like there's an emerald up in there. This should finish off really soon here. I'm hoping about 900 seconds it should stop. I was really surprised last series uh, when it kicked early because <clears throat> it should only be <clears throat> like I don't know 15 minutes and we're just about at that right now 30 seconds 27 seconds left so 
So it's just kind of a waiting game at this point. Yeah, I really expected these to go crazy. It might it might be another another area that's really gone crazy. So let's see. There it is. That one is gone. Now it should start killing these off in order. The order that I place them in should should finish them off. So I'm trying to get over there. Save some power a little bit. Let's go check the timer on this one. And the timer on this just about done. Looks like, yeah, all the animations and stuff are all broken. Uh, I might have to tell DJ about that. But this one should, should kick the bucket here in 30 seconds. Yeah, four cryos in one episode. That's, that's a record for me. At least they're all getting they're all getting magma. That's good. And what this will do is the the corner the corner cryos will grow a lot faster now. There is this one. Good to go. I can deconstruct all this stuff later. Oh, come on. Get under there. And this one's the next one. Giving me some power. Lots of power. Arthur is already dead. Need so much power for this jetpack. It's crazy. Alright, looks like we've got Cryo over here in a big way. But uh, it's not being blocked at all. Oh, we've got uh, Dazzlers coming in. So yeah, this one definitely is, is growing towards the Magma Bore, which is why I put it on this side. And then the, the lights that I put in, uh, the torches, keep it, uh, keep it on a straight. Uh, it keeps that clear, regardless of how much cryo spawns in so yeah another 50 seconds on this one why these are really why why do you hate me why did you stop there you go taking out as much of that as possible yeah, this right here marks where the Dazzlers look. So any cryo beyond here, they don't even see. And all of this stuff has just fallen. Don't care where it goes. We got a, a little bit of errors. Little squares of errors there. Not too bad. And this should be it for this one. Bingo. Oh yeah. Forgot they do drop hearts. I don't know where the other ones went. I might have to go look for those. Those are valuable. I need some power first though. So the other one will be will be dead here in just a few seconds. Holy cow, that's a lot of power I drained. Okay. Can't really 
mess around with that Dazzler right there. So we're going to bounce out of here. So yeah, I, I thought they dropped... I thought they dropped the, like, the Hive Brains. But... I might have to go look for that. See where this one dropped. They shouldn't despawn the brains, but that other one was quite far away from the spawner. So who knows? There it is. Oh, I just needed to look around a little bit to find it. Fill her up. I think you should be able to pull power out of those batteries a little faster. Get get my uh, jetpack foo going pretty good here. Okay, so the last one on the list is this one way over here. Should be just about dead. And I'll go grab that other brain. Ooh, this one is growing like crazy. Uh, let's pull some power here. Give me all the power. Okay. Ooh, yeah, there it's growing. That's what I expected from the other one. That's the kind of growth that I really expected from that other one. But, uh, yeah, apparently he didn't. This has 34 more seconds left. And the torches, in you know, make sure that it's got a clear line of sight regardless. Lots and lots of cryo over here. So, 10 seconds... And this one will be defeated. And done. Okay, where did the... Where's the flashy, glowy... There it is. Yay. Alright, and that... Takes care of four different cryos. Four of those babies, all gone. Beautiful. I need to go grab that other brain. Because, because reasons, I want to... Uh, let's see, where did that go? Yeah, over here, I think it was the one that I still needed. Who knows where that one landed? Okay, look for the... Uh, I'm not seeing... Where it went? Did I already pick it up from over here? Oh yeah, I'm I'm cold. I am very very cold. Give me give me power. Come on, see that battery. See it? Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, just in time so yeah I'm not seeing where that other that other brain went oh I've got four of them okay so I've got all of them never mind alright well that will do it for this episode and I thank you for watching and I will see you next time